Hello guys, uh, it's a good tutorial on making sort of uh, advanced depth of field camera in motion. Uh, I'd like to recreate sort of Gaussian uh, blur that uh, we all had in version 4.24 and earlier versions. Uh, then it was withdrawn with the circle dot. And uh, I thought that without using HLSL and post process, I actually can uh, use the cinematic camera to make sort uh, of the bokeh effect. So, uh, cinematic camera is a physical camera, which actually works pretty much uh, yeah, yeah, like uh, in the real life. So, you need to adjust the focal lens and the aperture. The higher focal length is, it means that it's the portrait, and the lower value is, it's the wide angle camera. With the aperture is, uh, like, the higher value is, less bokeh you will have, the lower value is, the higher bokeh you will receive. So, all you need to do is to select your person, uh, like your character, and instead of the simple follow camera, you go with the sign camera. Next, here, under the lens settings, we need to customize the minimum f-star. We need to go with something small like 0 0.2. Next thing is to adjust focal length. Uh, while you adjust it, you will uh, see that horizontal fork will change. Uh, default fork is 90 degrees, so to achieve uh, similar results, we will need to go with the value of 12. And for the aperture, play around with the value. I found uh, that this value uh, suits me better than ever, than everything else. Uh, so, lens, aperture, and minimal f-stop. It's the basic setup, uh, it can be adjusted as you like. I just want you to show this trick, because I know a lot of uh, people like uh, love that uh, bokeh effect from the Gaussian block. Next thing is to make it work uh, uh, automatically with our character. For this, for the beginning play, from the sign camera we need to extract focus settings and use set member in camera focus settings. Then here we need to uh, select only those fields that we need to be overridden. It's focus methods and tracking focus settings. For the tracking methods we go tracking and for the focus settings we go with make camera tracking settings. Here we need to pin only actor to track and use self as the reference. When it's done, you will receive the bokeh effect, which works pretty much nice. Uh, it works with the camera boom uh, pretty well. Adjust the lens and you will receive quite good results. Play around and I hope you like what you've seen. Uh, so, uh, please subscribe, leave your feedback. Uh, Patreon, Discord, everything is uh, under the description to this video. And uh, see you soon.